Our colleague Joyni Bazarika caught up with NPP Meghalaya President and Rajya Sabha MP W.R. Khaluki for his views on the exit polls prediction. So we are being joined now by NPP's Meghalaya President W.R. Khaluki. Sir, uh, exit poll uh, predictions have come in. If we talk of Meghalaya, it has been predicted to have to be having a fractured mandate. NPP, uh, it is being said that NPP will get somewhere around 20 seats. Uh, what do you have to say on that? We fought this election. We have set a target and we have set a target of getting, I mean the target, 25, which is uh, sure. And beside this target, we have another 24 seats like we call the stride rate, in which we are fighting. So if our target reach as we we are you know projecting then i don't see that it will be a hung assembly we will surely get an absolute majority well sir uh, it is also being said that uh, bjp is uh, is going to increase its tally this time uh, this time it is being predicted that the, that the bjp tally might reach somewhere around 10 so in case in in case they are in case of a hung assembly if your targets meet uh, if you if you feel short of target uh, is the npp open uh, to an alliance with the bjp considering that that, that this time you got, uh, both npp and bjp uh, went solo and there were like some uh, there, there were like some uh, friction seen between both sides you see the thing is uh, well, you, you're giving the BJP the maximum exit poll, which uh, usually it doesn't happen. BJP will not, will not get 10, they will get 6, that is the minimum. So another ally of the NPP is the UDP. They also went solo, they also raked up issues like corruption and all against the Conrad Sama government. But again, they are still, uh, they are still within the MDA, even now as we speak. So, uh, so in, in the time of the government formation, again, if the numbers fall short, uh, uh, are you keeping your uh, options open for the UDP as well? I was telling people, I said, this uh, raking up issue of corruption is nothing but because of the, we having an election. That's why people try to take advantage of everything. If you look at the result, people have voted for MDA. And so, uh, if we talk about the 2018 elections, back then, even though NPP and, uh, ended up forming the government, the single largest party back then was the Congress. This time, however, going by the exit polls, NPP will emerge as the single largest party. Even though if, whether the majority mark comes in, that's a different thing. But Congress, it is being say, uh, it is being predicted that they're going, they're going to suffer huge. Like like in the exit, exit polls, it was shown that their tally is going to be below 10. What do you have to say on this? Well, you see, Congress in 2018 is a force. But it is now a divided Congress. So this time, uh, how much of a factor do you think TMC might end up, or, or do you think TMC may even be a uh, maybe even be an option if the need be while forming an, any alliance for the government? You see, if I told you that uh, only when we when the result is all counted. So let us see how much TMC will get when finally the result comes. And so, uh, uh, or, or for your party NPP, what are your predictions? How much you guys are going to get? Me, my prediction is that I see that we may go beyond the 26. So that was NPP Meghalaya President W.R. Khaloki speaking exclusively to Northeast Live on the exit poll result.